everyone, it's Harry Frankfurt and today I'm going to be doing a quick little Dear Diary video. This is a very, very, very old diary. The first entry is from... Uh, oh, it doesn't tell me the date. 2009, at least. Um, and the things I wrote in this diary were a little bit ridiculous. So, um, yeah, why the hell not? You know, may as well share it with the internet. 19th of April 2009. I may have to edit out some of this stuff, but I'm hoping it's not too drastic. My life right now is rather boring. Sydney from Tuesday to Friday. Work Saturday and today. Think it was boyfriend tomorrow? Uh, and school back on Tuesday. So, what is new? I hate... I hate first boyfriend and first boyfriend's mother wants to give me money. I am once again in love with sidekicks, the phones. I'm still in love with them. I'm writing an all right vampire novel thing. I have to do an English assignment, a business assignment, study for a health exam, and prepare for other crap school might chuck at me. Um. <clears throat> Uh, yeah, so apparently that was boyfriend that I was referring to here, boyfriend tomorrow, because I say his name again, and I say that they lost their virginity, uh, and that it was awesome, and I'm gonna miss, <laughs> I'm gonna skip that next part. I'm saving up so me and boyfriend, subject to change, <laughs> can go to LA and I can get the sidekick, then when I get back, I save up for a Telstra plan. <laughs> Oh my god, that's so funny. Last night I deleted all the messages I had from first boyfriend and his family, so now I have more room for new boyfriend. Oh my god. Tomorrow my cap renews and I'm going to take it easy for mum. On Thursday I'm going to give mum some money for my bill. Actually, I might just buy the sidekick off eBay. eBay. Okay, so. Um... Let's go to the next uh, entry, why don't we? So that was the 19th of April, 23rd of April. School went back on Tuesday, the 21st. The night before I took... Okay. School went back on Tuesday, the 21st. The night before I took two morphine pills because I was in genuine pain, went to sleep, and the next day went to school. I left an hour and a half, though, through the day sick and in pain. Oh, my back was messing up here. Mum picked me up and took me to the physio to get it sorted out. The chair we use for the computer is inadequate and causing me major problems. Yeah, I've been having back pain for a long time apparently. I wasn't pregnant and I had to mention that I wasn't pregnant in my diary. Tomorrow I go back to school and then work as I am apparently fit enough to do so. The book I was writing earlier is temporarily missing. Yeah, I left that book on a plane, I think. I think that's the book that I left on a plane. I was kind of really happy with it too. My plans for the future are set. Psychiatry, set up center, then if possible, open Swedish restaurant. <laughs> I don't know why I thought I was going to be a psychiatrist and open a restaurant. Uh, Oh yeah, and then also have the boyfriend involved somehow. <laughs> My 16th birthday is coming up, as is the release of the new sidekick. I'm saving up for it. As of my birthday, I haven't... As for my birthday, I haven't a clue how to celebrate it. Mum is getting more and more upset because I keep wanting to have a party and she wants a low-key dinner for just me and boyfriend. Me and my friends like to party. Oh my god, I was 16. How would I know whether I like to party or not? It's a thing. <laughs> okay, sure. Only thing is, boyfriend and my friend hate each other. And if I throw a party and don't invite her, I'm screwed. And I can't invite her because of him, so I probably shouldn't have a party. Perhaps something classy and expensive with a theme. <sighs> I was such a child. I was such a child. 1st of May 2009. This is going to be the last entry that I read. My birthday is in 15 days, so I, I so want people to get me money so I can get the new sidekick. So that's one topic gone. Another would be that I miss Sydney. 
I miss my Sydney friends. One of my friends was in my dreams last night. I was introducing her to my boyfriend. I think I really miss her. Her sense of humour, her spontaneity, her energy, her love, her endless life. <sighs> I think I was trying to be poetic there. I truly love that girl. True. She's actually coming up for my birthday this month. Um, I wonder if she ever thinks about me. Yeah, good question. And I realized last night, in the very same dream, I am a little curvy or bendy. I do like girls, not as much as guys, but still. Actually, come to think of it, maybe equally. I've been with two guys, and I have, a, I have little loving feelings for my ex, whereas my ex-girl, <laughs> I love her with all of my heart. And the little amount I knew, insert female name, I love her also. I care about her, and I wouldn't at all be surprised if I saw uh, one girl and was turned on. We are incredibly close, and I think nothing will change that. As for men, I don't have any feelings at all towards X. Often I want to engage in cruel acts toward him. That's just nasty. Perhaps I hate him for all the shit he put me through. Perhaps I hate him for forcing me to put up with it for so long. It was an abusive relationship. Not physically, but mentally and emotionally. Now that I have a new boyfriend, I'm secure that and can be sure that will never happen again. Newsflash, it did. <sighs> yeah, it takes me a few times to figure things out. <laughs> so perhaps now I am due for a new topic. I'm going to be a psychiatrist. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, good one. Oh, that's funny. Then, one com once comfortable in all that, I will open a Swedish restaurant. <laughs> I'm sorry, I can't help but laugh. I refuse to fail. I'm doing my work. I'm trying. I'm working. I'm determined. By the way, I ended up failing high school. So I wasn't working that hard. Wh what else have I been up to since the last time I wrote in here? Me. Uh, oh my god, this is when I started my YouTube channel. So, um, what else have I been up to? Blah, blah, blah. Um, I took prescription medication that wasn't mine. Don't do that, kids. Uh, I started trying to lose weight. Got into the habit of skip... Oh, skipping for a while every day. Okay, so it's skip rope, not skipping. Uh, and then I started making videos on extranormal.com out of cartoons and forcing them to say stupid stuff. I've also started adding random people on MySpace and then there's work. It sounds like I'm busy and cool and awesome and ninja and shit, but really it's just normal. Oh, and school, sorry, forgot about that. By the way, some things to keep in mind. When I say I feel sick, it's the lack of eating. I may say I ate too much, but it's just because I ate something and my empty stomach is making noise about having to process it. I word it like this to train myself not to eat. Saying that food, saying that makes food the bad guy, which it is. Mm -hmm. You tell him, sister. Yesterday was scary. Mum has been nagging me to do this government thing because I'm turning 16. I've been procrastinating. I didn't want to do it. She would nag, tell me to do it when my brother was off the computer. Then while we waited for him to uh, get off the computer, she would fall asleep and it doesn't get done. Yesterday she nagged uh, and I got really upset and I'm not going to read that part. This is too much for me, so I'm going to change the subject. I love this pen! <laughs> Just a cheapo ballpoint, but really good writing quality. Very smooth. Now my right arm is hurting and numb because I'm on my stomach, leaning on it. I'll have to write later. By the way, I failed maths. Literally wrote that. Oh, and then there's... Okay, here's, this is what I used to do all the time. I don't know if you guys can see that, but at the top it calls itself song, and then there's like nothing for the first verse, and then there's just a chorus, and that's all it says. So guys, that is a uh, few entries in my diary from when I was like 15. Oh my god, that's a terrifying thought. Yeah, I didn't realize that I was quite as sick as I was, but apparently I was. And yeah, that boyfriend that I said wasn't going to be a problem ended up being a problem. And as for the sexuality thing, I don't really know what I am. Um, I'm sorry I didn't 
mention as much as what was in here. There's a lot that I kind of have to not talk about because, like, it's not good. <laughs> Uh, if you guys like these videos, there's a whole playlist that I will link down below and you guys can watch them all and maybe I will be releasing my diary entries as a book. Make sure you subscribe and you will see me in the next one which will be up tomorrow. Okay? Bye!